Next stop, Windows. So I'm going to go back to Lightroom. And I'm going to find a frame that has the windows somewhat properly exposed using flash so I can quickly and effortlessly mask those in. I'm thinking this is going to do it right here. See how I've got flash inside. It's too flashy, but I've got a great, perfectly exposed window view. I'm going to edit that in Photoshop. All right, and we'll again shift click and drag that onto our working file. And what I'm going to do is I've used the flash to expose the interior correctly. But now what I want to just do a quick and easy window replacement. I don't want to use the pen tool. This is a great tip for all those real estate guys who are like, you know, I got to turn around five jobs in a day. I can't spend all this time with the pen tool. So I'm going to alt click, set that to black. Remember that flash kind of properly exposed the interior. And I'm just going to focus on the windows. And I'm just going to brush in our window view. But because the interior is properly exposed, those window frames aren't going to look goofy. OK? And see how we just got a great, quick and easy window replacement without much effort at all because we used a flash frame which lit the windowsill and the window frame and then just used a mask to quickly brush it in. And we kept all the shadows everywhere where they're supposed to be. And by and large, things are looking pretty good. So quick and easy window replacement tool. If you don't want to do the agonizingly long route of a pen tool, or you can get away with it, pop a flash, expose for the window frames and the exterior, and then brush it in. Works in many situations. Sometimes it's too complicated, but something like this should be easy.